What is going on, game or nation? It is your host, Gamer Not and today I'm bringing you guys a commentary on Call of Duty V Black Ops 3. I'm actually very excited right now. I'm in a pretty damn good mood. It's, it's another uh, day in the life of Mr. Nightwing, and I'm just in the middle of watching uh, some old episodes of Walking Dead right now. I, I haven't watched the new season, the season 6, mostly because I always tune in at the wrong time, so I'm always watching episodes too late. So right now I'm, I'm watching season 5 where I'm at episode 10, and it got me thinking of how I would do in the zombie apocalypse. Just, just things I think about when watching The Walking Dead. But really quick, let me know how you would do in the zombie apocalypse. If you don't want, if you don't know what you would do, you don't feel free to, you know, not uh, tell me. But let me know how you personally think you would do in the zombie apocalypse. So, anyways, let me give you a background of my environment, and I think I, I would survive a lot easier because of I live in the city. I live in New York City, not New York. Well, I live in New York State, but I live in deep in the heart of New York City. As in, there's a few blocks from here. There's a fast food. There's a Popeyes nearby. So. And there's a grocery store nearby too, so first thing I would do is I, <laughs> I, I would freaking rob the grocery store of like everything they have. I'm pretty sure everybody would go there too. I'm sure there'd be a few people at Popeyes, so I'd probably just skip to Popeyes, right? There's like a, a, a parking lot there, so I, I would make like a fort of, of cars to block like the windows and the doors. And then I just go inside and stuff my face with some unhealthy Popeyes and see the zombies staring at me through the window. But what happens when a zombie comes inside, Nyren? What are you going to use to protect yourself? That is a really good question, actually, because if, if you're living inside Popeyes, there's really not much you can use. Unless you want to beat somebody over the head with a fucking chicken leg. I don't, I don't think that... Oh, or maybe you can use, like, chicken legs as, like, a distract... Yeah, that could work, actually. Like, yeah, I can throw some, a, a chicken drum, like, across the Popeyes area and just... It'll be, like, a herd of zombies over there or something. <laughs> I really don't think zombies would. Pretty, I think I would do very, very well in the zombie apocalypse. Because another day, I, I just thought of like I don't know where. Like if you put like the tables like upside. Actually, I don't think you could flip the tables in Popeyes. The Popeyes that I have. Um, well, speaking, of, I'd get some tables somehow, and I'd put I put it so that it's laying down, so that you can't really go over the counter. You have to get over the table first. I don't know how to explain it. If you kind of like put it down, so they don't have to step over, it, and those zombies being stupid, they're not gonna be able to get to me. So I think I'm pretty much clear, and I, I, I guess I'll beat him over the head with like broken glass or something. I, I think I'll be very, very fine in zombie box. But that's gonna about wrap up this video. Oh, and really quick, I was actually thinking of starting a vlog really soon. Um, I'm thinking of doing like another like a day in the life or, or something, something like that. Just me at home. It's not gonna be anything so interesting. It's just you know another day or that of things that I do at home. I think you guys would enjoy. I think it'd be pretty casual. And it's something I, I think would be very, very fun to do. So if you guys are still watching at this point, please feel free to give this video the biggest, meanest, fattest like. And as always, guys, I shall see you guys in the next video.